I have an appointment with Emily Charlton. Andrea Sachs. Before Emily Blunt was Emily Charlton, she had to step up her fashion. Her people, while at the Academy Museum of Motion Pictures, an evening with Emily Blunt on December 14th. The actress says the Devil Wears Prada director, David Frankel, actually asked her to change up her style. Emily recalls, he said, look, I would cast you, but the studio was wondering if you could wear something more stylish. To be fair, I was wearing a hoodie and jeans when I auditioned for it. But Emily got it together for her second audition in London stringing together an outfit a bit more in line with her character. Keeping details of her look tight-lipped, she continues, I thought I looked fairly chic. I don't know, it probably was awful. But landing the job was the exact opposite. Of starring in the 2008 film alongside Meryl Streep and Anne Hathaway, she adds, I mean the experience was, it was heaven. That movie was heaven. We had a party. It was just, you can tell it was just exquisitely fun. It was the time of my life. During the December 6th episode of Variety's Actors on Actors, Emily also reflected on her time working with Anne. Did we meet before the table read at Devil Wears Prada? Was it at the table read? This is so embarrassing because I remember every second of the first time I met you and you're like, did we? No, because I <laughs> also so am very no, blurry on I'm most just memories. I'm but... so much more into you than you are into me. <laughs> I remember walking into the room and like turning and meeting you and I just, I remember going like, hi, buddy, in my head. Oh. And instant thought, I was like, what a movie star. What? First thought, I th I like, there was like, you were like shedding stardust. And Emily felt the same admiration for her soon to be co-star. I didn't know New York, I didn't know anyone. And you were like the warmest embrace and you were so good to me. And even though you were a colossal movie star at that time, there was, you treated me like a complete equal to you always. You are one of the people I've known longest. We've known each other for 18 years. 